let me show you how you can add your form into a sales pitch system that's called Deal Intent. So let's get started with this video right now. Welcome to Job Form. My name is George, and I'm going to show you how to embed your form in a sales pitch system. This one is called Deal Intent, and the idea of having a form inside of a sales pitch system is to have customers who you are dealing with to have a way to contact you or provide you information. It could be a contact form. It could be a form so they can provide you information about their company. It could be a payment form if you want to provide a payment form inside of the sales pitch. So it's really good to have this form inside of there. So let's get started. Let me create a really quick form that we're going to use for deal intent. So let's start from scratch, classic form, and let's add some basic elements just for testing purposes. So full name, we'll add some long text and the email. Okay, we're gonna keep it simple, but you can make this as complex as you like or the type of form that you like, okay? So let's go into publish and we're gonna grab this link. So let's go ahead and copy this link and jump over to deal intent. So this is deal intent and what it does, like I said, let me preview this template, is a sales pitch system. So here we go, here's the sales pitch. You got introduction, expiration video, expiration video, sorry, slide deck, case study, etc. But what if we wanna have a form inside of here? Well, that is possible. So let's create a deal room. Okay, let's name this test jot form, all right? Deal name with jot form. Deal stage, it'll be a prospect. You can name it whatever you like. Deal value, 1000. The close date, et cetera, the company. We can create a new company. In this case, I'll just use one that we have already here. Let's go ahead and create this. Okay, here we go. Now we have a sales pitch room. So remember, we have the contents on the left and we're going to add a block. In this block, we're gonna scroll down here and we are going to find jot form. So let's go ahead and select jot form. Here we go. And we have the option to embed the code, which is using iframe. So if you go to embed iframe, or you have the quick way to use it via link. So I'm gonna use a link, which would make it much easier. Let's click on the link, let's add it here. Let's go ahead and save it. Okay, here we go. Now we have the form inside of here. We can go ahead and name this section, contact for example, or whatever you'd like to name it as your own. So we have a content, we have contact, and we have a form inside of here. Let's go check this out. Let's go ahead and preview this. Okay, let's pretend that this is a sales pitch page right now that we wanna deal with someone. And they'll have all the data right here. And at the end, when they click on contact, they have it here. Like I mentioned before, it could be a contact form. It could be a fill out form, for example, for their company data, or it could be a payment form. And it's super easy to embed it here on this sales page that's called Deal Intent. So if you wanna embed your job form forms inside of Deal Intent, this is the way to do it. So that's the tutorial for job form and deal intent. If you wanna leave us in the comments what you think about this integration, do let us know. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that little bell notification to get notified when new videos come out. And that's a wrap.